Hello everybody, I'm Mrs Carter, I'm the Executive Head of St Martin's Church of England Primary School and I'm delighted that you've selected St Martin's to send your child. We are really, really excited to meet you and can't wait till you can start school and join our school family. Um, St Martin's is a wonderful place to be and I know that your children will be exceptionally happy in our care during their years of school. During our time here, the children are going to have lots and lots of fun and make really, really good friends. Um, we're hoping that they will be incredibly happy and secure in the adventures that they will have. In partnership with you, we hope that we can work collaboratively to enable them to do their very, very best. At the church school, we're underpinned by our school Christian values of compassion, love, wisdom, perseverance and forgiveness. And these things really help us direct the children as they go through their day-to-day -day life. The children use these as guidance tools to help them make relationships, make friendships and more importantly to learn. During these difficult times it's very hard to make acquaintances with you and we're hoping very shortly that we'll be able to use remote opportunities and remote meetings to make connections and get to know you a little better. In that way we'll be able to talk to you about the different ways that we can bring you into our school family and begin to get to know you and your children in preparation for their, their start in September. Hello, I'm Miss Major and I'm the Class R teacher. I'm really looking forward to meeting you all soon. Soon you'll receive information about joining a virtual meeting with myself to talk about your child. This year, I will also be running a new project called St Martin's Explorers, which will give your child the chance to regularly see the early years team and the early years environment. I hope you will join in with this. Meanwhile, stay safe and I look forward to speaking to you all soon. Hello children, my name is Mrs Johnson. I'm going to be your teaching assistant when you start your new school in September. I'm really looking forward to meeting you all. Have a wonderful summer holiday and see you in September. Bye bye. Hello, I'm Miss Toka and I'm one of your teaching assistants in Year R and I'm really looking forward to meeting you soon. Goodbye. School. If you have any concerns about your child's learning or their development, please feel free to talk to me. You can contact me via the school office or if you speak to your class teacher, to Miss Major, she'll be able to put you in contact with me. I look forward to seeing you all in September. Bye. Oh hi, I'm Paula White, I'm the Family Liaison Officer. Um, basically my job is here so I can support you as parents, help you with communication with the teachers when you're a little bit worried about small things, you don't want to talk to them. You can phone me and you can email me. Um, I do work with children too, supporting them. Um, and also I do referrals to outside agencies. One particular one that you might be interested in is the nurse referral. Um, in they're open all through the summer holidays. They can give advice on bedwetting, sleep issues, or eating issues. Um, <clears throat> if you would like their information, it's on our website under Flow, um, and it's got their phone number, and you can self-refer. Um, other than that, I think that uh, really, I think you should really enjoy the summer and look forward to seeing you and your child in September. Thank you very much. Hello, my name is Miss Ewins and I'm the school secretary. Thank you for all the admission packs that have been returned already. I look forward to meeting you all in September. Stay safe and have a lovely summer. A new page has been created just for you on the school website. It can be found in the parents tab. We hope you'll find it really useful. In the coming days and weeks, we'll post lots of useful information about our virtual welcome meetings, activity sessions, information booklets and lots more. As part of our transition, there will be the opportunity to have a video meeting with myself where I can get to know you and your child. Information about how to join this meeting will be sent to you the week beginning the 8th of June. Please let the school know if you cannot attend your allocated meeting time. Meetings will take place in the week beginning the 15th of June. This year we are launching a brand new project called St Martin's Explorers. There will be three virtual story sessions with craft activities. In each session there will be a story and there will be some crafts. You can pause the video to give you time to complete them. You will each be given a bag with some resources in for each session. Information about these will follow soon. 
Please feel free to send photos of your child completing these activities via our School Celebrate email. The first session will be uploaded to the school website on Monday the 22nd of June. We really hope you'll join us for these sessions as they will give your child a chance to regularly see the early years team and become familiar with us as well as having some fun along the way. In July there will be a virtual teddy bears picnic which will be posted on the school website. There will be a story and some crafts for your child to do. Please join in with this with your child, their teddy bears and don't forget your own picnic. Information about the school uniform can be found on the school website in the Parents tab. Channel Uniforms supply our uniform with the school badges on. Information about this is on the school website. Your child will be able to come to school in their PE kit on two days per week. These days will be given to you nearer the time. Please make sure that all items of clothing are clearly labelled. Please take a look at the Communication tab on our website. This has our school number, email and also links to parent mail and our school app. Both of these are important ways we communicate with you and parent mail is how you book your child's school dinners online. You will receive some instructions on how to do this nearer the time. We also have our school Facebook and Twitter page. Each term, Class R has their own parent newsletter. This will let you know what we will be learning and will include important dates and information. You can also find out what your child has been learning about at school by looking at the Children's tab on the school website. In the Class Learning tab, each class adds photos and information about what they have been learning. The School Day The school gates open at 8.35am and registration is at 8.45am. There is a breakfast club which starts at 7.45am. Information about joining this will be added to the school website. We will start the day with a phonics session, followed by phonic or physical development activities. An example of this is Doe Disco, where children will develop the muscles needed to support them with writing. This is followed by a short English session, where we will share stories and develop speaking and listening skills. As the year goes on, we will develop our reading and writing skills. In Year R, we do daily phonics sessions. Phonics is a way of teaching reading where your child is taught to read letters or groups of letters by saying the sounds they represent. Children can then start to read words by blending the sounds together to make a word. Parental involvement with this is key. We'll be holding a phonics workshop for parents and in this we will explain it all and give you ideas for activities and ways you can support at home. There will also be stay and play sessions where you can take part in phonic activities with your child. At St Martin's, our curriculum aims to engage children through their interests and the topics that we learn. We learn through play and we have a good balance of child-initiated activities, small group learning and adult-directed learning. It is really important to engage children with their learning and with each book or topic there will be a hook to get them excited and engaged. You can see some examples of this. It might be a set of footprints, a character or a mystery object that sparks their imagination and the learning journey continues from there. We then move into our first child initiated session of the day. This is an opportunity for children to choose and direct their own learning through play. We call this dream time. D for discover, R reflect, E engaged, A active learning, M make links in their learning. During child initiated time, a snack of fruit and milk which is free until your child turns five is offered. Children have access to water throughout the day. Their first water bottle is provided by the school After we've tidied up, we move on to a daily mathematics session. This is very practical and children will be active in their learning. Then it is lunchtime. Children have the option of a hot school lunch or a packed lunch if you prefer. School meals are free and you can see a typical menu on our school website. School lunches will need to be booked via parent mail. Information about this can be found on the school website. After lunch, there is another session for child initiated learning or dream time. We have daily stories, rhymes, songs and dances together. Home time is at 3.15. Please let the school know if someone different will be collecting your child. There will be two PE sessions per week. Your child can come to school in their PE kits on these days. You will be notified of the days near the time. In Year R, we teach the children the skills they will need in order to read. 
We teach the children through phonics and we practice these skills at school. It is really important that we have your help to embed these skills with daily practice. The first books children take home will be a picture book. These don't have any words but they are a vital stage in reading development. Children talk about what they can see and they can create their own stories. We encourage children to talk in sentences when they are talking about the book. Then, when we have started our phonics sessions in school and the children are beginning to recognise their sounds and can blend the sounds together, they will be given a book that links to the phonics sounds that we have learnt at school. We also encourage children to read widely and for pleasure. Bedtime stories are really important and help encourage a love of reading. To encourage this, we have Rocket the Reading Rabbit. Rocket loves to read and he is very lucky because each term he will get to go home with each child in the class to hear a special story that has been chosen for the class. Over the year there will be opportunities for parents to come into school in our stay and play sessions. You will be notified of these on our class newsletter. We hope that you will be able to join in with these. Thank you for watching our virtual induction meeting. We hope that you have found it useful. Meanwhile, stay safe and we hope to see or hear from you soon.